Hello everyone, my name is Chiri and I'm part of the technical support team here in Comap. Today, I would like to focus on topic how to connect to the controller. So first of all, you will get our controller in box. So you need to put it on your desk and prepare power supply. For that purpose, you need to look for orange terminals and prepare a suitable voltage 8 to 36 volts. When the power supply is prepared, you can plug in the cables. You should immediately see that the diodes are light up. The next thing that you will need is uh, the USB cable, USB A to B cable. So prepare this one as well. And last thing, what you need is uh, IntelliConfig. IntelliConfig, it's a tool that it's used for those new controllers and you will find it on our Comap web page. So you can either search for it here in the search bar and here on the right side is a section of software and you will find their installation package. So after the registration you can download it. Or for you, uh, you can, uh, that don't like the search bar, you can also go to products, software tools, configuration tools, and IntelliConfig, it's over here. The rest of the procedure, it's the same, as mentioned before. IntelliConfig, it's already installed on my computer, so let's start it. Okay, so we can see that program, it's uh, initializing. Here is the bar that shows you the percentage. And we will get to uh, this page where we can decide if we would like to start with connection to controller or start with the offline or start from the scratch from new configuration. So in our case, we will use connect to controller. Here we can see several options for connections. So it can be air gate, ethernet or serial link. In our case, we will use USB. So it's serial link and I will plug the USB to controller and also to uh, computer. Here on our right side, you can see detected controller. So I can just double click on that and uh, the connection will be established. And here you can see successful communication between uh, the controller and our uh, computer and uh, IntelliConfig. So thank you for your time. And if you will have any question, do not hesitate to contact our technical support.